You know I've been thinking of you since the 14th of June last year. Gemini season, seven months spent fighting my demons. I don't know why you've got this hold on me. Live in my head a rent free. Seem to live without you, at least in my mind You've been so unkind And you, you get there claiming that you love me Next day you can't even bear to trust me How you think that feels? We on a rule that we Alright, so I have a few reasons why First one would definitely be to put myself in a position to provide for my family, 100% um, I come from a single mother background and just to be able to, you know, take care of everyone, that just like, I guess it's everyone's dream, but bad. Um, second one would be to provide um, a really good example to my sister's children. Just like show that we don't have to keep living these fucking mediocre lives, bro. Like if you have a dream, go for it, you know what I mean? I really, really like that. It's just so Dream collab. Um, in this present moment, probably Pip Miller. She's one of my favorite artists at the moment. She's from the UK. Super sweet voice. But in general, I've always wanted to make like a mad drink up jam, like an island jam, you know what I mean? With like Common King, Sammy J, or you know, you know the rest. Um, I am from the capital of Australia. I live in Canberra, I've lived here my whole life, dipped to Sydney for a year, and then I came back. Um, so I started making music, started recording properly in a studio last year, um, but I've been making music pretty much my whole life, I'd say. But yeah, it's usually just been, you know, jamming on a guitar, I've taught myself ukulele, um, used, to, um, used to upload covers when I was in high school, and yeah, it's just always been, always been about it, you know? Thank you very much, that is super sweet of you. Um, I've never been one to put myself out in this kind of realm, so I'm very grateful. I haven't clubbed with anyone from Canberra yet. I do have a little something cooking up with my bro, Turquoise Prince, and I would love to make a song with Party at Eleven. 1050% bro. Um, my family is so supportive. My mum and my cousin are definitely two of my number one fans. Shout out to you, Michaela. Yes, you can't. Um, but yeah, super supportive. Um, in five years, super cliche, but just to be financially secure, hopefully on some island in the Bahamas or some shit and performing live. Uh, my favorite artists from Sydney, I really enjoy the whole drill game. At the moment, probably Sydney Youngins, definitely on repeat in the car. Um, Melbourne, I love Kazaya, she's so good, bro. HP Boys also, and Brisbane Lissy. Yes, I am single, but no, I'm not available, I'm not looking, I don't want none of that, alright? Favorite artist of all time, I always get stumped on this question. Of all time, I have to say Michael Jackson, dude. 100%. Um, so I'm actually at his studio right now. His name's Jamie Morris. He's the best bloke I've ever met. Um, at Burrows Digital, if you need, like, the best, hit him up. Um, I haven't played any shows yet. I've only got one song out, so I guess when I get a, like, bigger catalogue of songs, we'll see how we go. Um, seeing as it's my main source of income at the moment, I don't think I'm ever gonna stop. <laughs> I don't have an OnlyFans, bro! Um, besides music... One of my main passions is like spirituality and mental health and all that kind of stuff. So that's definitely a hobby of mine. A hobby? I don't know if you call that a hobby, but I love to cook, I love to eat, 100%. Um, and I'm into fitness as well. Favorite upcoming artist? I love Party at 11. Um, he's a local camera guy. He's got the vibe, mad vibe. Um, August Loom, my mate from Sydney. And who else? Me. <laughs> Appreciate you, my cuz. Full blown, like you're just such a great guy. I cannot. Um, what I learned to sing, I don't know, in the shower. Poly scene is in like, are there lots of Polynesians here? If so, yes. <laughs> if you're talking about music, um, there's definitely like a lot of dudes doing it, but it's definitely not as big as anywhere else in Australia. Opinion on poly women making music? I wish to see more of it. This music shit is literally in our veins, like. Um, I wish there was more platforms and like I guess more more girls doing it. Yeah Artists dead or alive um, at the moment probably I'm DDB She's like the, actually the coolest girl. I think I've ever seen in my life. Hell yeah, dude Pro sex work pro Polynesian women doing whatever the fuck they want to do pro any woman doing what they want to do and let's protect our women 
Southside in the South, my whole life. Rep it to the desk. Two six double one, baby. Snapchat is Lance to Polo. Every every single social thing I got is Lance to Polo. Is that because the quality of the video is a shit? I'm filming on Snap. But if you did want to buy me a new phone, more than welcome to. In my spare time, typically I am at my sister's house. Hanging out with the kids, watching Netflix, this and that, or eating. Both, yeah, go hand in hand. 150% all day, every day. I would love to collab with another female. Fucking are you joking? I always wanted to collab with Turquoise Prince, my Canberra bro, I think that is definitely in the works. But I also would like to make a bop with a driller like out here by HP Boys and Kazaya, that would be mad. Just want to say a huge thank you to FTA for having me on the Q&A tonight. Um, I had heaps of fun answering all the questions and I hope you enjoyed getting to know me. My name is Lani. My first single, Captain Hook, is out on all streaming platforms. Later.